Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I will be reading My In-Laws Are Obsessed With Me, episode 73. I'm a, ugh, it sounds like I'm whispering a little bit right now. It's because my baby is sleeping. It is nighttime. It's pretty late. But yeah, let's go ahead and get started. A few days later. Why is everyone nervous? <gasps> oh. Huh? I don't want to go. We're not going that far. You're only going just outside the capital. Lord Fina said he'll come back to the residence once a month. Uh, that's right, Elsaletti. Just think of it as a fun trip. But still, I don't want to say goodbye to Parashati and Selfie. My lady. We'll be off. Oh, she's crying so much. Oh. And so Lord Phineas, the Phineas left with a sleddy. The former Grand Duchess is also leaving to take care of the delayed business back in the Grand Dukedom. Will he vacate the residence in the capital as well? My in-laws are obsessed with me. Episode 73 The social season is almost over. And this is another letter for her grace. A lot of people are going back to the Grand Dukedom and would like to see you once more. As for the letter from the from the Duchess, I'll respond saying I shall partake in the next gathering. I have to go see my uncle soon, so... Hmm? Send this to the Count. Yes, Your Grace. Bloop, bloop. Mm -hmm. He must be thirsty. We invite you to share with us a celebration of love and commitment. It would be our greatest pleasure if your graces, the Grand Duke and Grand Duchess Lapillion, would honor us with your presence in the celebration of our marriage, bride, and groom. Whose name? I can't read that. Hmm? My dearest Parashati, I'm getting married. I did invite you both since it's customary to specify who, both the husband and wife when sending an invitation to a married couple. But I don't want to trouble you. It's fine if your husband can't make it and you can come by yourself. Better yet, if you're occupied as well, we can meet some time later. Do let me know either way. Hmm? My goodness, your grace. Oh, you look absolutely stunning. We also prepared other gowns fit for a guest at a wedding. It is an honor to be called here once again. Oh, but what if her grace outshines the bride? That would be quite troublesome. Well, that can't be helped, can it? <laughs> why why is it that I get exhausted even quicker than before hmm? uh, come to think of it Adia sent me a letter saying he was disrespectful to you did he maybe it's nothing to be concerned about uh? If that's her response, it means he did something terribly wrong. I shouldn't bring him up again and risk displeasing her. <laughs> it's about time I cut that bastard out of my circle of friends. They say they said they'd marry when her fiancé inherited the title of a baron. I can't believe that the time has already come. They truly seem to be in love. I'll take the third gown. Yes, Your Grace. 
Shall we ask him to make an outfit for his grace with the same design? Oh. I think he's going to come. Seeing how he's, we signed a marriage contract to help one another. But a lot has happened so far, so I don't even know how to bring it up. Your grace. There were some new fabrics that came in recently. I thought they will be well suited for you. They're not the promised gowns, but I felt inspired, so I made them in your size. We measured a while back. Would you like to try them on? They'll be quite nice as an evening attire. My goodness, look at the quality of the fabric. Oh. Please, uh, try it on. Even you want me to put it on? Oh, everyone's like gleaming. You made her grace pick her own clothes before as well. I think you should have paid more attention to her. You said you care more about the rumors, did you not? That you should start from the residence. You should have acted even before her grace asked. For married couples, invitations from friends are as important as other gatherings. I saw the Grand Duchess sending a letter to the Count on regarding some business. Pardon? Oh, yes. This time she's making preparations with her kin in the countdom. For what? I don't know the details, but I think she's preparing for the future. Oh, and I also gave her the documents on the former Countess Zahart, but she didn't say much of it. Oh, oh your grace. Good afternoon. Her grace is changing inside. You heard him. You should wait out here. Uh, what? What? Well, I'll be over there looking over some documents. Oh. Hmm. Hi. <sighs> Let me take a break for a moment. Uh, oh, I think she's coming out. Wow. Oh my gosh. Look how beautiful she looks. Oh my. Mm. Huh? Your grace. Oh. The. Oh. oh. Why? Why did you stop? Um. I, I forgot to ask you earlier, but. The wedding. Would you like to come with me? Oh, she looks so pretty. Oh my gosh. Of course. Oh, thank you. Your grace, please be careful. We don't even have any duplicates for these. Uh? Your grace, your grace. His reaction. I've never seen him like that in my entire time serving him. <gasps> Don't tell me. He's... What do you think about this gown, your grace? I think it looks amazing on you. It's perfect. I want her by my side. I want to be able to look at her all the time. Oh, my heart just fluttered. Oh, fluttered. I'm sorry. Oh, wow. All right, guys. If you guys enjoyed the way I read and reacted to this webtoon, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, drop some comments, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.